Justin, you guys are notorious for teaming up and playing practical jokes on your castmates, but we heard that you no longer play jokes on each other. Mm -mm. Why is that? No. Uh, we learned very early on that we were much better as a team than pitted against each other. Uh, <laughs> That's BS. We, we knew we had, too much, we, we had too much access to each other, so yes. it was like, well, I the, know where he lives. And, he knows where and the access, it, I think it, it became very apparent when uh, when he walked into his trailer one day, yeah. and uh, the entire thing had been completely destroyed. And yeah. remember when you used to get those, uh, they used to sell like stink bombs at like yeah. Spencer's yeah. or yeah. something? Oh, no. I got my hands on several of them. Yeah. And they, oh, and, no. So his, they had to get him a new trailer. It was kind <laughs> And that's, I think, when we decided, you know what, like, truce. Yeah, truce from here on out. This is going to go. Uh, and, and much to the demise of, of our other castmates. Uh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're, you know, we're now better they're as the a victims. Team. Yeah. When we, yeah. there, yeah. when we yeah. had other people finally show up, it was like, ooh, common enemy. <laughs> so. I was wondering if you could tell us about any pranks that Jared and Jensen have pulled on you. Well, if you guys have been keeping up with the show, uh, I've been on a little bit of a break. Uh, People have been trying to find me, uh, which hasn't been going particularly well. Um, I've been saving this story, so this I actually like I I maybe mean, have to give you a demo. So uh, in the fall, uh, Jared and Jensen were nice enough to be like, "Hey, man, would you like to come have dinner with us?" And what would you guys have said? Sure. I heard a no back there. Someone was like, "No, nah, dude, no dinner for me." So they took me out to dinner, which was really nice, um, and it, it, the bill comes, and I go, I go like, oh, like here, here's my card, like I want to make sure I'm at least getting some of this, like out of respect, it's nice. So then I turn to my left, and uh, I, I hesitate just for the, the quickest of moments. Don't you think about it too long, you know what they say, he who hesitates disintegrates. And I turn back, and Jared has sliced my credit card in half. <laughs> So, <laughs> this is not an onset prank. This is them pranking my real life now. Uh, just, if, here, uh, bear with me for a second. You can have the couch if you want. I don't sleep much. Oh, I, I don't sleep at all. <sighs> it begins. <laughs> <laughs> this is the actual half that I've been too lazy to get rid of. So, uh, yeah, that's the best I got for you. Thanks, Jared. All right, we're good to go. Really? Yeah, the sheriff gave her the old Alabama slammer. I'm pretty sure she's a girl. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? The Alabama slammer? <laughs> we haven't done that in years. Good luck. Hi. 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 My question is, what is the best prank you pulled on Alexander? Um, <laughs> hey, by the way, round of applause for Alexander. I think y'all are the first, um, I think you are the first people to meet him, right? No, so, second. Second. Okay, where are you going to be? Yes, second. <laughs> <laughs> I feel, so we've had people on the show who talk about it's really intimidating to come on our show, which is funny because we're like, what the fuck? <laughs> My microphone is broken. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? Um, we're goofy, we're silly. Um, um, so, but I think they're like, well listen, you guys feel comfortable with the crew, you know everybody by name, you know their kids, their wives, their husbands, their friends, so it's difficult to walk onto the show and kind of immerse yourself. You know, we're, we're making jokes before takes and dirty takes, and everybody's like, oh, I don't know what to do. 
So he came on the show, and he's a very hardworking guy. He's a lot like Misha, where he came on, he's playing a character that's different than himself, and he he's a serious actor, and then he shows up and films with us, and Jensen's talking about, like, lately. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <laughs> Some stuff. And baby driver and baby driver and Lisa found a friend. Before the deputy was killed. Holden, well, who's driving? That's baby driver. Holden, who's driving? That's main driver. <laughs> <laughs> so, we're, we're, we're not, we don't really, these days we don't prank specifically. We more just kind of mess with them while they're on camera. Which is really an awful thing to do to another human being, but suck it. However, <laughs> Misha, just, Misha said uh, on Friday, uh, he said that when he first started working on the show, uh, that we were being such idiots and, and being so <laughs> not professional. <laughs> and he said that, he, in, you know, to himself, he was thinking, he was like, oh my gosh, is, is this actually what's happening here? Like, is this, how, how does this happen? Like, how does, how do they get any work done? Like, how, like, I can't believe that these guys are just like this loosey goosey on set and like aren't really like concentrating. Like, and that was when he first came on. Now he says, if we are concentrating and serious, he doesn't know how to do his job. Anymore. He's concerned. He's like, oh God. It's like, what's going on? Something's wrong. They're not trying to pull my pants off. They're, they're not kicking me as I walk by them anymore. Why? What is happening? All right, we're good to go. Really? Yeah. The uh, sheriff gave her the old Arabian goggles. <laughs> <laughs> this is right about the time where Alex is like, wait, how many episodes do I have to do this year? I just love that we've created an environment like that. <laughs> Where people are nervous if they're not being abused. Yeah. <laughs> Spade has uh, said the same thing. He's like, why aren't y'all messing with me? What's going on? Like, what, what's, what's y'all dashingly doing? Which is the ultimate prank. <laughs> it takes a while, and you really have to commit to it, but eventually the payoff is just not doing anything. <laughs> Thank you for your question. Thank you. I love you guys. Love you back. It's getting worse, not better. That's the problem. Hey, it never gets better. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Hi, um, I just want to say that I love you both very much, and I think, I believe I speak on behalf of everyone in this room that we're all thankful for everything that both of you have done for the Supernatural family. <laughs> Is, is if you guys can tell a story of a prank that you guys have pulled behind the scenes. There's <laughs> more coming down the pipe. We'll see. I think I, I believe they called it uh, Hazy Part One. Right the so initiation Part One. Yeah, yeah. Um, so there will be more parts. Um, Sheriff, I gave her the old Alabama slammer. I'm pretty sure she's in there. <laughs> the Alabama slammer? <laughs> we haven't done that in years. It's so specific, it's more spur of the moment. I, I laugh constantly because we have, like this episode, we have a lot of uh, actors and actresses in it, and we're all very talented. And that's happening got a who's who of uh, like, fine actors that I think should work with the past and fans of this and that to come to me on the show. Uh, 
and it's it's it makes me laugh to see them watch us, and we're goofing around and this and that. They call action and break into character, and they're like, "Wait, wait, what? What? Wait, 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 wait we're shooting? Wait, what?" We looked at them, <laughs> on sort of like a couple steps behind us, almost like I was the end of it. So off the top of my head, it's not the thing It's more just we have a good time. We we uh, the people who come on our show, it's just wonderful. They're always like, "Hey, y'all have a great set. Like, this is a good place to be, fun place to work." And I think we're trying to keep it. Nothing malicious. Just sort of like moving around. We had a scene the other day with Misha, and, and it was just the three of us. And, uh, this isn't Benjamin's blade. Is that an orgasm? We have to go. You know what? <laughs> I almost, You're almost made there, it. man. Did the bunker's warding just fail? Bunkers warding. <laughs> you awesome. That's awesome. Bye. Right. All right. Come on. You know what? You're awesome. <laughs> Thanks. Um, you too, I guess. <laughs> <laughs>